Hello everyone, and welcome to my channel. In this video, I explain to you how to create a GPO, to disable Internet Explorer on all client computers that join the domain. After Microsoft issued the cessation of support for Internet Explorer, and that the future of Internet Explorer in the next stage is Microsoft Edge. So I will create a policy to disable Internet Explorer. Now the good thing is Microsoft Edge is IE, built-in mode, if you have apps, and a website that rely on Internet Explorer. This is the good time to start using the IE mode, and test the apps for compatibility with Edge. And the first step, to disable Internet Explorer, is to open Server Manager Dashboard, then, click on the Tools menu from the top, of the page. And from the menu, click on Group Policy Management. After opening Group Policy Management, select and expand the server on which you will create the policy, then, Right-click on the Group Policy object, and from the menu, click on New. And in the New GPO window, enter an appropriate name for the policy that you will create. The appropriate name will make it easier for you to access this policy easily later. Then, click on the OK button. Then single-click on the Group Policy object, then go to the other side, and right-click on the GPO that was just created. And from the menu, select Edit. This will open Group Policy Management Editor window, then, move to the left and access the path shown, in front of you on the screen. And I will leave you the path, in the description of the video to facilitate access to the policy you want. Then go to the other side that contains the available policies, then look for Disable Internet Explorer 11 as a standalone browser policy. And double click on it, to open the policy. Then enable the item named, Disable Internet Explorer 11 as a standalone browser. This enablement prevents Internet Explorer, from running as a standalone browser. It redirects all attempts to launch Internet Explorer, to the Microsoft Edge browser. Under the notification to disable Internet Explorer browser, you see some options, which is never, which means select this if you don't want to notify users that Internet Explorer, is disabled. The second option, is always and choose this option, if you want to notify users every time they're redirected from Internet Explorer. And the third option, once per user, is used if you want to notify users only the first time, they are redirected from Internet Explorer, to Microsoft Edge. Select the appropriate option for you, then click on the Apply and OK button. Thus, the policy was created, you can now close the Group Policy Management Editor. The final step is to link the policy we just created with the OU you want to apply it to. Right-click on the OU, and from the menu click on Link an Existing Policy. And select the policy, and click on the OK button, and thus it has been linked to the organizational unit, called Test. Then open the client computers, and make sure that the policy is applied to the client. I hope the video is useful to you. And thank you for watching. And I also hope to subscribe to my channel. Thank you all.